The passion of surgery started uh, since I was a child, actually. I loved helping people. My name is Dr. Sarah Al-Bastaki, consultant colorectal surgeon in Sheikh Khalifa Medical City, Abu Dhabi. I'm also the division head of general surgery. In addition to that, I am actually a president of Emirates Society of Colon and Rectal Surgery. Tell us about your journey and uh, how you've reached uh, where you are today. The passion of surgery started uh, since I was a child, actually. I loved helping people. When we were, we were children, we liked to play around with the kits of medical tools and all this, so I knew that I liked to work with my hands. What motivated me when my sister, Dr. Tsam al Bestegi, actually, she traveled to Ireland to pursue her medical career. This was a really a highlight for me and my mother, who always supported all of her children to be one of the pioneers to serve this country. So she invested in all of us. When I finished my high school, I went to Royal College of Surgeons in Ireland, Dublin, and I stayed there for eight years, and I even worked there. Then I came back to pursue more in a surgical career. So. The thing is, we didn't have as much residency program established, so uh, my country supported us to travel abroad to get the experience from expertise abro in abroad. So I went to Germany. I did my surgical residency program there. I had to learn Ger German language. It was tough, but it was beautiful. I finished that, then I did a fellowship in UK, United Kingdom, in colorectal surgery. Uh, then I came back in 2018 and I started my job in one of my very well-known uh, hospital, Sheikh Khalifa Medical City in Abu Dhabi. It's one of the largest hospitals in Abu Dhabi. Can you tell us about the awareness that is building on uh, rectal cancer, for example? Not much is said about that. The awareness, as you're aware, that um, Abu Dhabi is the first city who started to do colorectal screening program at the age of 40. Usually other countries, they start from 45 50. So Abu Dhabi is the first in the world so because we have high prevalence of colorectal cancers among people in Abu Dhabi and UAE. So we said prevention is better than cure. So we needed to go a bit younger to do the screening. And the screening program is uh, really simple. It's either you do as uh, a fit test, which, which is a stool sample to be given and you can detect it in laboratory, or you do a colonoscopy. The second thing what my part came, like I wanted to build up a society. I'm a founder of um, Emirates uh, Colorectal uh, surgery Society, and um, this is under the umbrella of Emirates Medical Association. Why I started this society? It's because I needed to enhance our surgeons to know more about how to implement the updated management for patients who have colorectal diseases. So if you have a society, you can connect with other expertise, expertise around the world. You can connect with pioneers, you can bring them. For example, I'm going to um, have a Congress in March, which will be the first Emirates International Colorectal Surgery Congress. And I'm going to uh, bring uh, people from Gulf, from the regional and from international who are actually established colorectal surgeons so we can exchange our experiences together so to build a better colorectal system uh, among uh, the hospitals. It's uh, the 51st UA National Day. Do you have a message? One of the messages that really inspi I was inspired is uh, the, biggest, the bigger your dreams, the bigger your achievements, as Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum uh, said. The greatest achievement in UAE is to live in harmony and to provide a very peaceful environment. In addition to that, I think all nationals and residents of UAE, they are aware that UAE is providing a very peaceful environment, such as um, laws for expats uh, to uh, actually to protect the rights. So we are one community and um, we are brothers, sisters. Uh, so happy National Day, everyone.